Alright, so first you're gonna do you have to stick your hands. It does not matter what side it is, but it's good. You have a longer one. Focus on stretch your shoulders. Spine straight, vertical, palms, ball my head, okay? Mm -hmm. Stress my shoulder. Don't elevate it. The traps, relax your shoulders. Okay? Gonna breathe in and out. Stretch your shoulder front and to your okay? Relax your shoulders. So we're using this three, five times. So breathing in and out. Okay, after that, you're gonna swing it back. You can actually expand the palm you grip it wider, and you're gonna roll back. Okay? Last and stretch, you work out with ten cups. You can bend your elbows a bit just to get out the leverage. That's fine as well. So you gotta breathe in. Exhale, breathe out. Okay, this is kind of warm up for stretching. Your shoulders, breathing in and exhale. Good. The next one is to be your back, your uh, scapula. So I'm taking my left hand on top, right palm under. So I'm first going my spine, lumbar, back it. Okay. I'm going to shift the bar to my left shoulder up here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to stretch the tension. So I'm breathing in and out. In. I'm letting all my left hand do the work, okay? And out. If that's not the case, you can use the right as well at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Breathe in and out. You're going to stretch the tension, release the tightness. Breathe in and out. Try it five to eight times. In, out. In and out. After you're done, take your right hand on top, left palm on the bottom. Same concept, the other side. On your right scapula, breathing in and out. In, out. Breathing in, out. I'm bending my knees, stabilizing the grounding. I breathe in, I breathe out. I'm breathing in and out. The next one, I'm taking my right hand on top. I'm going to shift it 45 like this, and I'm going down, two more, my uh, rotator cuffs, breathing in and out, breathing in and out, in and out, other side, left hand on top, right palm on the bottom, I'm turning 45, in and down, breathing in and out, in and out, one more time, in and out, good, now, this last one I have, my left, my top, my right bottom. I move it to my right side under my toes, my other major right here. Breathing in and out. In, out. And in and out. Good. My right hand on top, my left hand on the bottom. I'm doing the other side. My toes, major, my There you go. Breathing in and out. In and out. Good, so that's the back. Now the quad, you know, pull your body. So I'm gonna sit down, fourth palm down, move my quad inside muscle. I have my right leg on top, my forward, I mean, my left leg on the bottom. My core is stabilized, my toes are straight. I'm gonna breathe my breath, okay? So I'm not using muscle like this, okay? You see me flexing? You don't want that. You wanna. Let the torso follow, I should relax. So that was deep massage. So breathing in, and relax in, in deep, exhale. Breathing in, exhale. So with the more quadricep, more uh, upper spongious. Breathing in, mm -hmm. and out. Okay, that's to get it locked, not out. Mm -hmm. Having pants much easier because I'm not, my skin won't, you know, catch it. So, now inside my medial, that's the medialis right here. I'm gonna separate my left leg, stabilize my right leg grounding. Inhale, exhale, in and out. You do at least five to eight times. Other side, that's the model. So same thing, I'm putting my right inside a little more, palms down. I'm relaxing, gently breathing in. I relax my body, not to my torso, my whole body kill me as I move. Breathe out. You're not using your strength. You can be tired, that's why. So you want to relax. Gently moving in and out. Lean back, refine your core, and exhale. Same concepts, okay? Left leg. 
straight, I'm relaxing, pull the gravity, and back, breathe in, and out, good, in, breathe back, exhale, inside again, in, and try your core, breathe it out, you can feel really relaxed when you do this, moving the blood, okay, you got three times, I know that two, this one, other side, exhale, breathe in, and out, breathe in, and out, last, not least, but now, Hamstring, yeah, that's a bit tricky. So if we go under, I'm gonna have a bottom grip, super grip in the bottom. I'm gonna go in my hamstring. So I have a bicep bonus, trying to notice this right here. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna relax my leg, reach my core. I'm gonna come back as I'm breathing in, and I breathe out forward. In, and out. If you have to be backward, that's fine as well. Bring in and out. You can change your grip to more pronate. Mm -hmm. That feels uh, more fancier. Now that's the, the neutral one. I go inside. Inhale. Exhale more inner thigh. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale on the side right here. Then go lower. So that way you have enough space. Then I'm breathing in. This is more bicep pronus. Right here. Mm -hmm. So inhale, exhale, more lateral, inhale, exhale. So that's how you do general calf, give you a quick one. You can do calf, so you just gonna lift the leg, back, that's how you this. So you don't wanna dorsiflex, you wanna relax, and palm down, inhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. So you do the neutral, then you do more, Medial, inhale, exhale, relax my body, exhale. I don't use my strength. And side, inhale, exhale, breathing in and out, in and out. So that's pretty much it. So practice that every day and you can feel really good and relaxed. You're not going to tighten this muscle.